Guys, welcome, welcome, welcome back again to the weekly news and market analysis. And for purposes of this week, I will begin with the volatility indices, discuss and get deeper into the overall top-down analysis based on how I'm looking at the market from the monthly, probably, but most of the charts, I'm looking at them from the weekly chart all the way down to the daily. And for purposes of this conversation, if you have not subscribed to Traders Lounge, kindly hit the subscribe subscription button on the bottom of this channel. If you have any comment, any question, I encourage you guys to kindly drop the question on the comment on the comment section. And I'll create some time and go through one by one to be able to respond to you and to be able to guide you. And part of the house rules is we are... We do have an online uh, online class on trading. So if you really want to get deeper into the kind of analysis that I'm doing, kindly drop me a DM on our DM on our social media handles. You can find us on Facebook, our Traders Lounge page. You can also find us on 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 Instagram. You can also find us on on Twitter. Every every handle is within the description of this video. And other than that, let's jump into this market analysis. So this week, we have very interesting setups, but most of the most of the most of the setups are still on a consolidation zone. But I will be able to help you identify from a top-down analysis the kind of levels that we are looking into for us to be able to carefully look at the marketplace. Remember, patience is critical, and without patience, guys, you cannot be able to really get to be successful in this game so i'll begin with the booms and the crashes and then i'll do a separate video on the the, the, the volatility indices the v's and the jumps are we together so for purposes of this week's analysis let's begin with the boom 1000 as you can see from the weekly market analysis this is an ascending channel and as the market is ascending, we have been on an extremely long consolidation area with an ascending triangle that is slowly by slowly getting to an exhaustion. Two things. Number one, for the immediate purposes of this week, you can see this week's candle has begun and it has just formed a very smaller week that is bullish. So for purposes of this trade, if you're not already into this trade, this is a trade that you can take with the target exit being at uh, being at the 13168.24 area 13160 so 13189.2 area because anything other than that we would really love to wish to exit the market and see how the market plays my bias is the moment we get there we still have an unfinished move to the downside with a possibility of breaking this support within this rectangular channel as highlighted for it to come and retest the bottom of the ascending channel, which is at around 116.58.5 area, before now we get a solid confirmation of the move to the upside. But the move to the upside, guys, if I can be able to show you, the move to the upside has to be, has to make this move. Let me show you this, this size, that size. So for purposes of uh, this conversation up to there. So our long-term target, therefore, is around uh, just a minute. Our long-term target is therefore around, uh, let me drag this thing. Our long-term is on this red box up here, which represents, uh, which represents the... 159 56.9 area so that is generally how i look at the boom 1000 it's a very perfect trade 
but in the meantime we are still on a consolidation area so this is a trade that can take even two three weeks to get up here or even a week you never know but the moment it gets here let's wait and see guys but otherwise if it breaks above these and closes below it then that will give us a potential to the downside to retest this level as indicated let me just mark these levels to retest the 116.79.54 area before now we have a strong momentum to the upside this is the trade i'm waiting no matter how many weeks it will take this is the trade i'm waiting that you can actually take set and forget and it will make you crazy crazy moves just as we saw on these move to the upside there great then boom 500 boom 500 is an interesting setup and for this one we have an opportunity on the short term already as you can see on the daily candle we are up, the price are short from the red box this red box is extremely critical but guys be careful this is not the time to enter into this trade you will wait for a consolidation and for a pullback to be able to now get into a perfect buy from this box that will take us into the 4570.858 area this is our immediate tech profit this is one of the critical trades for this week but guys as i've said let's wait and see what happens because we are retesting a short term high on the dailies we may have this price console we may have this trade consolidating or retracing even down further to this red box again from which you can be able now to buy to the 4570 858 area then now uh, we have uh we have boom 3000 sorry 300 for boom 300 i had analyzed this trade three weeks ago and it's playing perfectly in relation to what we had analyzed this is a weekly setup and as you can see price retested the lowest of this support line out of which immediately price has been going up so for this week let's expect this price as you can see we, we expect this price to come down further probably close this week at this red box down there highlighted at the price of uh, let me just do this at the price of 2857.969 out of which now we can be able to take a medium to a medium term trade towards the equilibrium level represented by 7445.813 so this will be a retracement to the upside at least to retest the equilibrium level of 7448 so again apart from boom 1000 which is a long term but extremely nice potential setup boom 300 is our immediate unique setup because this can give us crazy profit and it is very very soon to making the move that we expect it to make so let's see how this candle closes for this week and we can be able to see the setup to take especially on a buy to the up to the new week to retest the equilibrium at 74.45.813 now that is it for boom setups let's move for range for range break we have a fantastic opportunity on the range 100 as you can see from the monthly we are on a pullback and the closest immediate pullback has to retest the equilibrium level before a further move to the upside that can take us to retest the previous highs on the monthly now when i come down to the weekly setup so this is where we are price has been coming back down and for this week i actually expect this candle to keep on going down and down and down down and down and down until we get to the 50 percent retracement which is represented by the equilibrium as per the chart and that is around 31 985.1 area from there we exit this trade and see what the market does but my bias is from here or any Thing below here which could represent all the way up to 61.8 percent retracement or all the way up to the the 79 this blue box is very big anything can happen here and this is where we will be keenly watching for any opportunities now to re-enter on a long-term buy 
However, the immediate take profit and exit on this trade is on the 50% retracement represented by 31985.1. So this is a perfect sell for this week. It's a trade that you can actually take with your stop loss above with your stop loss above these 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 blue this red box represented by let me show you represented by 380.48 380.48.4 area so this is a continuation to the downside before we see um, any move to the upside right then on to crash crash is interesting a perfect perfect buy we've been buying from last week the immediate tech profit for this one is 80 14.894 so you can hold on to that trade until that particular point if you did not take it please wait i'll do a, a midweek analysis for, for us to be able to analyze this further on any pullbacks can, that can give us a potential to re-enter again <clears throat> i'll do an analysis on wednesday or thursday and update on that one then we have crash for crash we are on an extremely critical area as you can see so this is a perfect perfect buy on the this is short term that is the eight hour chart if i go to the weekly or the monthly rather this this is a bullish trade we are on the bias is on the buy in as much as we have been consolidating but as you can see we are on an extremely critical area that should give us an entry for a buy to take us all the way to the 179.17911.324 as our immediate tech profit in the short term and that marks the end of the boom and crash analysis good luck trading if you have not subscribed kindly subscribe kindly refer share let us promote this content so that next time when we release a video like this youtube will be able to notify you thank you for your support and thank you guys cheers